Understanding Sperm Donation, an English Language Guide. Hello everyone, and welcome to our language learning series. Today, we're going to explore the concept of sperm donation. This topic involves some specialized vocabulary and is a great example of how English handles sensitive and scientific topics. Let's dive in and understand this phrase in detail. Sperm donation is a medical and social term. It refers to the process where a man donates his sperm, the male reproductive cells, to help others achieve pregnancy. This is often done through a medical facility known as a sperm bank. The donated sperm can be used by individuals or couples who face challenges in conceiving a child naturally. In this section, we'll look at how sperm donation typically happens. It involves several steps. 1. Screening. The donor is thoroughly screened for health conditions. 2. Donation. The sperm is collected in a private, secure setting. 3. Storage. The sperm is then frozen and stored. 4. Usage. When needed, the sperm is used for artificial insemination. Sperm donation raises important legal and ethical questions. Donors might have legal rights or responsibilities towards the child, and there are ethical considerations about donor anonymity and the rights of the child to know their biological parent. These aspects vary greatly by country and legal jurisdiction. This section explores the varied cultural and social attitudes towards sperm donation. It's a topic that intersects with views on family, reproduction, and technology. Understanding these perspectives can enrich your comprehension of English in a social and cultural context. We hope this video has helped clarify the meaning and context of sperm donation in English. This topic is not just about language, but also about understanding the cultural and ethical nuances involved. Thank you for watching, and see you in our next language learning adventure.